Okay, so uh, <coughs> we will have this equation just now. And then we can integrate so that we can get this equation. And the right hand side, we, we can integrate it. So we will have integral uh, uh, component plus C. Okay, and then we can put the exponential component at the left hand side to the right hand side. And we will have the final uh, formula. This is the formula that we can use. Uh, is it a formula or actually uh, the most important thing is the concept that you need to understand eh? so uh, this is the concept that you need to uh, grab eh? this one eh? uh, this is the main concept uh, this is the main equation and we multiply with the integrating uh, factor g so this is the final outcome Okay, so uh, to have a, a more understanding of this concept, we can go to the example 10.17, right? So we go straight to that example. <coughs> Solve dx dt plus tx equal to t. Okay. Remember uh, the formula. We know that uh, g t is equal to the integrating factor g eh, uh, equal to e k t. So remember this. And you need to know also what is k t. K t is equal to integral uh, p t dt. All right. Okay, now we write down the uh, general form of the integral equation. Uh, sorry, differential equation. So the form is this: dx and uh, dt t plus p t x equal to r t. Okay. Now we know that uh, when we compare uh, this equation with uh, these two equations, eh, we know that what is PT? PT is equal to T, only T right here. Okay. So uh, we can know that KT. K T is equal to integral P T, which is T, D T, and the answer is uh, one over two T square. All right. So this is K T, eh? and we can also find G, the integrating factor. We know that uh, this is the formula. So we can find gt. So gt is equal to e k t equal to e e mm, one over two t square. All right, because k t is right here. Okay. Now we can multiply both sides of uh, this equation with the integrating factor g. So multiply with g. So e 1 over 2, we know already what is g dx dt plus t e 1 over 2 t square x simple right t e 1 over 2 t square all right okay understand 
So again, we know that this is uh, in the form of product rule. So what we can do is we can simplify. So this one, we can change it into, turn it into a simplified form, which is E 1 over 2 T square X equal to T E 1 over 2 T square. All right. If you are not sure uh, how to find this, you can use the <coughs> the formula. Somehow it's like a formula. This one. Eh? So just put. Uh, we know the kt right here. So you just put the kt uh, function over there. Okay. Yeah? Okay. Now. Uh, we can integrate both sides. Integrate. And the outcome will be. E of 1 over 2 T square X. So the D DT is removed. And then the uh, right hand side will be. T e 1 over 2 t square dt and this will be e 1 over 2 <coughs> 1 over 2 t square plus c okay the t is eliminated and then we can find that x is equal to <coughs> 1 plus c e power of negative 1 over 2 t square. So that is the answer for this example. So this is the equation that we want to find.